What's up y'all? Hope everything's all good. Uh, today we're going to be going on about a classic cocktail, the Mojito. I think it's an awesome base for creativity, but the original Mojito also bears a lot of really good flavors. Uh, it's a really great drink to get if you're going to like a new cocktail bar or something and you want to see if the bartender knows their stuff. Because the Mojito is made of such simple ingredients, sugar, lime juice, club soda, mint, and the actual rum itself, you'll see if they can balance it and if it's worth your night of hooligan nonsense. So the OG Mojito origins are kind of mysterious, but just like most things that Americans love, it's probably coming from slavery. But anyways, let's go ahead and get started on making an OG Mojito. Let's get to it. We're going to need one ounce of fresh lime juice. And we're going to be pouring all of these ingredients directly into the glass that we're going to be using. Then an ounce of simple syrup. After that we're going to get a nice silver rum. For an original mojito you definitely don't want to go with a dark rum. We're going to do two ounces of a silver rum. But the way I do it is different from the way a lot of people do it. We're going to grab ten mint leaves. Smaller ones do pack a little bit more of that minty flavor without as much bitterness. So now that we have all that stuff there, we're going to go ahead and just give it a hearty very vigorous stir. All right. So the reason why we're doing this is that if you muddle the mint leaves, uh, if you ever look at a mint leaf really close, you're going to see a lot of little like almost capillary looking things. And you don't want to burst those because that has chlorophyll in there. And the chlorophyll is what's going to make your drink bitter. It does also add that green flavor. So you're going to notice that this is a little less green than most of your uh, Applebee's mojitos. Pop that off with a little bit of ice. Go. Let's go ahead and hit it with a little bit of soda water. We're using Topo Chico in this case. All right, we're gonna make sure you give it all a little mix. That way you're not just drinking straight club soda. Drink this drink with a straw. And let's see. Hmm. Mm. Wow, I gotta go in for a second fucking sip. Mm. Loads of flavor from the fresh, fresh, from the fresh lime juice. I am telling you, please don't use any concentrates, anything that's not fresh. Bacardi Silver Rum, a very clean rum. Then we've got some Topo Chico. Try using any mineral water. Uh, it's going to add a lot of really nice flavors. It's going to be different from regular club soda. And last but not least, the mint. By stirring it, you're going to get a lot of that flavor from the mint, but you're not going to get any of that bitterness, really. I like to stir it twice with the ice because the ice beats it up a little bit more to get the last little bits. But, mm. oh well. Really, really good drink. All right, so now for my take on the mojito. I love the light, bright flavors of the mojito, but I want to turn it a little bit more complex. So what I'm using an aged rum for starters. We're going to be hitting it with tamarind for a little bit of a deeper flavor than just the lime juice. And we're going to be using a beautiful lemon. So let's go ahead and start off with that. We're going to need one ounce of lemon juice. All right. Just like the last one, directly in the glass. One ounce of lemon juice. Then let's go ahead and hit it with one ounce of our simple syrup. We're gonna need two ounces of tamarind nectar. So um, this is really yummy stuff. If you've never had it, go ahead and try it out. There's loads of other flavors. So maybe, maybe you're not the biggest fan of tamarind, but I'm sure we can find something for you. We're gonna go ahead and hit it with three ounces of our aged rum. And add like, 12 mint leaves to this one, 11, and straight to 13, because fuck 12, right? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and give this a really nice stir. Wanna make sure you're really giving those oils time to express themselves in the drink. All right, and we're gonna add some ice. You don't wanna fill it all the way up with ice, because we still need to make room for that club soda. Let's go ahead and top it off with our Topo Chico. You kind of want to give it the lightest little mix. 
You don't want to get rid of any of those beautiful bubbles. You just want to make sure that the flavors are spread throughout the drink. All right, let's give this a try. Wow, so instead of getting that straight acidity, like the bite from lime juice, you're gonna get a nice little bit of almost like roundedness from the lemon juice. The tamarind really adds another bit of acidity, but it adds a lot of flavor. The aged rum gives it a little bit more complexity, and then the mint just adds really, really nice herbaceous flavors. Uh, this is gonna be my favorite one for sure. Mm. That's good. Well, try out both of these drinks. Um, next time you don't have anything to do for the rest of the day because these both are gonna be strong drinks. Since they're from Cuban origin, they're gonna be just like Cubans. A lot of flavor, it's gonna have a lot of personality. Please try them out, you are definitely gonna love this. But it was awesome to see you here. Um, I hope to see you back in this corner of the world. Take care, I'll see you soon, bye. Oh, that's hot. That's hot.